And welcome back to another episode of Legend of Dragoon, the redux of my original series. We are, we are about to enter Bale. We just finished off the Guardian of the Cave, which is just a giant snick. So, we're doing pretty good. We're progressing relatively quickly. Where is this? Episode 6, and we're already at Bale? Like, yes. we're already a good chunk into this. We're a good chunk into the first disc already. I did one damage. That did one damage. Because <clears throat> this is this yellow bird just gonna run away. If you do beat it, you get a substantial amount of experience and gold. But I don't know, maybe a total vanishing works on it. I doubt it. It might not be considered a minor enemy. I might have killed one once. But you need a quick ass fucking team to do it. Let's go to the Indel's castle, the Indel's castle, I should say again, in Bale. We've made it to Bale. Nobody can bail you out in Bale. Oh, that music is just the best. It's not the best in the game. Don't get no, but that's not. It's that's the best town music you've ever heard. Just, mmm. Do do do. Ooh, how do I get up there? I don't think I've ever really entered this area. Oh my god, it's Sir Lavist! Oh, Sir Lavist, please let me draw your portrait again. Again. Oh, don't move. It'll, I'll be, it'll be done soon, don't move. Are we doing this? Oh, Derek, you may as well go find something to do. Oh, he's losing his mind. <laughs> yes, here you go. Portrait of Lavitz. Hmm. Isn't it a little too handsome? I don't think so. Thank you, I'll treasure this. I don't think I've ever grabbed that before. Okay. I don't think I've ever gotten the portrait of Lavitz before! What the fuck is that used for? Is it just for selling? Like... Goods. Lavitz picture. It looks so real. We got the axe from the shack still. Father's Stone, War Bulletin, Special Edition, shows tension among Sindor and Serido. The prison key... I didn't... I don't think I've ever really looked at this. I wonder if Lavitz's portrait does anything later in game. Huh. That's just... Oh! Look at this. Quite the house. Quite the house. I could live there. I could enjoy. Is there anything back here, or is this... Pointless. I don't know. I guess quick pause. Bathroom break is needed. Alright, so there's definitely nothing here. <clears throat> cool. Cool little Easter egg, though, I guess. Pick it up, Lavish's portrait. I've never... I've never pulled that off before. I guess I should have explored more throughout uh, the city than I did. And 50G. Cool. I just stole money from a woman. Didn't mean to. Well, okay. Just kind of clicked it. I'm pretty sure Dampy's down here. I don't think his name's actually Dampy, but it could be Dampy. Hey, buddy. Ah, oh, drinks, drinks. Give me more drinks. I guess I gotta go find him some booze. The town... Fuck. The town drunk needs some booze. I think I can do that. Doo -doo -doo. What's in here? Apparently, I should explore everything and everywhere. Ah, spirits? Yeah, I've got good ones. A hundred per bottle. I guess. Christ, that's a lot of money for spirits. Jesus. Gotta do it though. The town drunk needs some liquor. 
And I know it's a way to get a Stardust. And that is one of the main aspects of this round of The Legend of Dragoon for me. Is I need Stardust. I really care about you. Get out of the way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Out of my way. Out of my fucking God. We will get everything we need. We will get everything we need. Here is Strand. Smells like spirits. And they're good ones. Oh, you're gonna give me spirits? Brother, you're generous. Well, I'll have it. You can barely walk. But I guess that's fine. Awesome. <laughs> Where am I? Where am I and why? Oh, that's the castle music. Oh. 20G. Picking up money everywhere. Oh, that tune. That brings back memories. Like, that just brings back childhood right there. How can we open this? I wonder. I think I got an idea. We go the other way. Oh. 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 What am I doing here? What the? F what relevance is that way? Fuck, I thought the whale would have been this direction. Looks like I'm the fool. Oh, I'm sad every time that goes away. I have to put that on my phone. Like, get a playlist of just Legend Dragoon tunes. Just, oh! No one's gonna ever understand how good that is to me. What in the dick dang diddly do? I just. okay. Well, we completed the first part of getting that Stardust. Uh, I, I gotta continue it later. Uh, I thought the wheel was in that area. Apparently the wheel's not in that area. But we have the first part of that quest complete. That's all that matters right now. Let's go into the blue! Weapon shop, weapon shop, weapon shop, weapon shop. No, it's not a weapon shop. You're just an item shop. I don't need you right now. I need items. All of them. I need swords, spears, bows, armor. You know, the goods. Where is it? Where's my weapon shop. Where's my weapon shop? What's in here? Or is this just a useless goddamn stuff? Stable. I'm gonna get those usuals. Do 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 do. Let's go. Okay. It's a water well. Acquired stardust. That's what we like to hear. Oh, this is an old man's house. Stardust is also known as the wishing stone, as the name implies. It is believed to fulfill the wish of the person who gets it. Yes. Well, I have two. How about I grant... T I get two wishes now. It is so weird that there's just random characters throughout this game that just... give you... tell you random tidbits of information about wishes and shit. I know the castle's this way. I gotta go to the castle first. I think it's castle first. Lavitz's mama later. I think. Weapon shop. Oh, Stardust. We're just gathering all the Stardust. I don't even know how many there is in the game yet. We got the Bastard Sword. We do not have the Sparkle Arrow. Arm it. Scale armor. It's not good for you, but it's good for you. Leather jacket, we got it. 
Uh, you probably already have the Salad. We don't need any of the guards. Bravery amulet. That just avoids abnormal statuses altogether. But, but see, I could just save up the money, buy all of that. I could. I could. It's not what we're gonna do. My reasoning, which to me is a fair reasoning, this is not a huge point in doing so. Like, it might be completion ashore, but, like, what are you accomplishing, which is buying... I shouldn't have bought the sparkle arrow. Um, now I got two. I could sell one, I guess. What is this place? It's a pompous place. Pompous place. Ouch, phew! Got a stardust! Okay, I see where I need to go here. See a few places. Oh! Listen to that! It's fucking magnificent. I know I'm tapping and hitting this fucking board a lot, but mm, I don't care. There we go. Open! That's what we needed. Now he's gonna run all the way back, get past Dran, go through the whole loop again, which that only took forever. Last time. Let's just go back down. I can't believe I cut the sparkle arrow right after I fucking bought the sparkle arrow. It's always the way. What do you say? This is... Oh, that's Arsur Lavitz. He really did come back alive. Did you expect him to duck? Of course he came back alive. He's Sir motherfucking Lavitz. We're gonna go through a couple other houses before we get back to Dran. Um, gotta keep looking for all the items. You might be able to just acquire every single item a shop sells you without actually fucking buying it, any of it. What do you got down here? Anything for me to steal. Okay. There is legit nothing down here. There's a hole in the wall. Is this a passage for mice? Well, okay. There's legit nothing down here. What is the point of building empty houses? What do you got to say? Do you know anything about the Vice Commander of the Fifth Knighthood. He is my boyfriend. I don't... I really don't. I don't know anything about the Vice Commander of the Fifth Knighthood. Not a word. Oh, Duran. I'm coming for you, buddy. I'm gonna run right by you, but I'm coming for you. So it seems like this whole episode might just be... We're running around Bale, trying to learn what I can, gather all the stardust, adventuring every nook and cranny that I possibly can. They really shouldn't have this under a castle where the king sits. Assassinations on kings happen all the time. People go after kings all the time. Why would you do that? And now I have a ladder? Could I have just gotten down here so much easier? than what I just did. If so, I might be a little pissed off that I did the whole run. Oh, look at this girl. See, that's that's a problem to me. Like, be really easy to invade the castle then, put a bomb under the castle, perform a raid of some sort. Oh my god, he's really going. Really going. Hey, Duran. Apparently, we're looping right around you. Do I have to watch this whole transition all the way back? Hmm.
Jesus H. Christ. That's all I got to say is just Jesus H. Christ. What an adventure. Get off the boat. I don't know what going straight's gonna do, but we're gonna do it next. There we go, Stardust. Christmas Christ. And straight we go! I wonder if it's just a full loop and we end up back where we were. Just We just loop around the other side of the castle. That would make some sense. Still not sure what that bar area is for, like, where we ended up once. Yeah, we're on the complete other side of the castle now. And we're looping right back in. Interesting. It's very interesting. I'm gonna climb that ladder next, too. See what the fuck that does. Because if it saves me time, it'd be much appreciated. Wow. Quite the boat ride. Oh, I thought he was going to say something like, wow, what a trip! But no. Okay, so there. I'm just looking at a Stardust thing here for a second. Okay. So there. I got the one from uh, the well. I got the one from the weapon shop. I got the fireplace one. There's one more castle one. I got that one that's hard to find. I think Lavitz's mother's house is the only other place. Didn't that get me 20G? And now I legit cannot. I have to loop all the way back around. You know, for all of the effort it takes to get into that room and to see that chest, in my humble opinion, you think they put something better than 20G in there. What's 20G gonna do for me? Nothing. Diddly. Whole lot of fuck nuggets. <sighs> so we can't go to Lavita's mother's until after we talk to the king, I do believe. I do believe the king is the pinnacle of this. And then we can go to Lavita's mother's. We can do what we gotta do there. Oh boy! Now there's one more Stardust in the castle itself. I should have eight Stardust... Se seven? Seven? Seven Stardust total after I get all of the ones from Bale. Where do I sit now? Because there's two more I know to grab now. We're at five, so yes, I will have grabbed them all. Happy times. There you go. Oh boy, Sir Lapis, when did you come back? When I felt like coming back. Why can't I get in that room? I just want in that room. Why do you make it difficult to get to the rooms with the things? Well, there's a thing. 50G. Apparently if I just keep stealing everything. Sir Lapis will come back. If I just keep stealing everything I can from royalty, I might never run out of money in this game. Just making up for that money I fucking lost. What is this? Stardust! Well, well, Sir Levitz, welcome back safely. Like, how would you think to click on some of this shit? 100G. I don't see how to get in that room, really, at all. That's the king's room. We're not going there yet. Okay. Okay. Looping around. Doing this little loop. Aha! So that's how we get in here. Bet you it's just fucking G. Active ring. 
Um, okay, Shauna, you already have the active ring. You... No, you don't. You just have a bracelet. So, you could get rid of the dispiriting. Okay. And the War God's Amulet, which would drop her attack down a bit. Well, I don't think you need Poison Guard now. War God's Amulet increases hit rate for attacking all 20%. Yeah, sure. Let's give him the War God's Amulet. I don't want to drop Dart's stats down right now. Not right now. Do, 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 do. I think it's time we, uh. I think it's time we talk to the king. I think I've gotten everything I'm gonna need. Hey, Kingly. I am the head of the first knighthood, Lavitz Slambert. I am back from the field. Oh, Lavitz, I was feeling uneasy because I heard you were missing. Oh, please make yourself comfortable, everyone. Your Majesty, it's more than I deserve. <laughs> uh, it was true. His Majesty was so dismayed that he couldn't see to his affairs of state. Oh, noish. Please don't tease me. Lavitz is a friend of mine from my childhood as well as a master of martial arts. Anyway, where have you been? After my first knighthood was wiped out, I was captured by Sandora and held against my will in Helena prison. What? In Helena? However... Thanks to the act of this young man, I managed to break out. Let me introduce these people to you. Dart and Shauna. These, oh, well, they are from Celis. I thank you for saving the Lavitz. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. In gratitude for this, tell me if you need anything. I have a favor to ask. Is it possible to take care of Shauna in this castle? What? It seems Imperial Sandor attacked Celis to take Shauna away. So they could come at, go after Shauna any time. And when I think of it, is that the reason you brought me here? Shauna, I can walk next to Dart. I have been working towards that. There is nothing we can do about the time we were apart, but I want to be with you forever. Unfortunately, you cannot leave her here. Imperial Sandora obtained the force called the Dragon and went on the offensive. We are holding the battle line hoax, but if the Dragon can fly at low altitudes and directly attack the castle, we cannot defend even with the high ramparts. There is no place safe with Sarah Donal. Besides, you do know how she feels about you, don't you? Shauna, it may be even more dangerous from now on. I don't mind as long as I can be with you, Dart. Well, I take back the request, but one more thing. I would like to ask a question to Minister Noish. Ask me anything, son. My head is filled with all the legend-hidden histories of the continent of Endonese. I was on a journey to pursue the Black Monster. The Black Monster. The monster that attacked Neat 18 years ago. The only thing I know is that he deprived me of my parents and my hometown. You were a victim of the devil? I want to hear everything. Please tell me about it. There is hardly any information left. Everything that was related to him was reduced to ashes. The only thing I know is, the Black Monster is called the Devil that Disobeyed the Great Existence, and it is known for devouring the God. Devouring the God. Yes, and surprisingly, it shows up in history beginning 11,000 years ago. 11,000 years ago is the same as the time of the Dragon Campaign ended. You're exactly right, Your Majesty. Instead, I will tell you the story of the Dragon Campaign. Oh, I love cutscenes. Especially these cutscenes. These are pretty well put together. As if they were gods, Winglies ruled over all living creatures and used them as slaves. The enslaved suffered a terrible domination and injustice. Their anger turned to a flame of fury. Then a gust of wind blew throughout the lands, spreading the flame to a blazing fire. The wind was Emperor Diaz. Seven incarnations of dragons served the Emperor. Their bravery inspired people to take up arms. Thus began the Dragon Campaign. It was a harsh war. Both people and Winglies suffered countless injuries and fatalities. 
After a long period of suffering, it was the humans who acquired the future. The age of humans had begun. It's quite the story, that one. And it's basically what the whole game revolves around, is the dragon campaign. It's like that was a big moment in the history of this world. The black monster appeared after the dragon campaign. That it did, apparently. Excuse me, sir. It's time for the war meeting. I see. Tell them we will come soon. Dart, Shana. This war will be partic a particularly harsh one for those who no longer have home to return to. The castle is very quiet now. It is best. It is the best place to think about your future. But this is our first time in a castle. Well, there is a place with a great view next to this room. Go enjoy yourself. The view from the castle? I see. Please excuse me. Off she goes. She is so hasty. Please excuse me, too. I don't know if I would excuse you, Dart. Quite the view. It is quite the view. From here, we can see all of Basil. Might we even be able to see Celis? Celis is over the mountain. Besides, we cannot see it anyway, because we are so far. I hope everybody is safe. I'm sure they are okay. Yes, they are. According to the brief by my aide, most of the people in the village are safe. Really? I am relieved to hear that. But it will take time to rebuild the village. Still good. I can meet everybody again. But we have bad news. Sandora is now readying itself to attack us. They are planning to use the dragon for the offensive on hoax. A dragon? If they release that monster in the battle, it'll be total genocide. Our role as the knighthood is to stop it. I am heading to hoax now. Maintaining the battle line will determine the future of Basil. Dart's making up his mind. I think we all know what he's going to decide. I have lived only for myself. I believed it was something I had to complete by myself, even if I had to leave Shauna and the people of the village behind. But when I came back, look at this. I almost lost my hometown again. Lavitz, I'm going to hoax with you. I don't want to see any more senseless bloodshed. What about the black monster? We have to end the war first. Once Dart makes up his mind, he never changes it. Of course, I am going to. I cannot stand the war either. I can fight too. You guys. Everything is determined and now we have to prepare. Then let's go to bail now. There are item shops, weapon shops, and my home. Please meet my mother. She will be happy, because she hasn't had a guest for a while. You've got it, Lavitz. Oh, and Dart's theme song? One of the best. Just one of the best. That's also going to go on a playlist at some point. So this episode has legit just been... Oh, there's a thing. Oh, there's a room. Oh, we got to go to the room. Oh, we can even go in it. Have I been in here? Oh, no, this doesn't seem familiar. Oh, boy. Hmm. You are the brave man from Celis. But this is the chamber of His Majesty King Albert. You are not allowed to go in. I think this is... This is the guy from Hell in a Prison. The cape looks the same. His head... His top looks the same. And he's just hunting through the king's room? I mean, I know who is in that cloak. I know who it is. I'm not going to say anything again for the people who do not know. I just can't believe he's there in the king's room like that. I never quite noticed that before. I thought maybe it was just the king's right hand. But no, I think yeah. Cool. That's per that's that's awesome. I know to you guys who don't know a thing about what's going on. It's confusing, but where am I now? Where am I now? I 
think I just found a guy who can heal up the poisoning effect. There's a library? Look, we have a big selection. Find what you like. Stardust believed to bring happiness to the person who collects it. <gasps> Thank you for the other Stardust tip. I see no items in this room, though. Just people with information. Okay, so we're gonna... This episode's almost done. I'm gonna end it here pretty soon. We're gonna go a little over 30 minutes. Ah, uh, yes. This is exactly what I thought it was. Welcome to the clinic. We can treat three kinds of... We can... Yeah. Yeah, I know what you can do. You... Is, can I go upstairs? I can. Well, I'll try that in a minute. Figure out where that goes. The healing light is somewhat mysterious. Heal me. Heal me! Why will nobody heal me? Maybe the clinic is technically upstairs! Okay, okay. Uh, that's people in beds, okay. I can't actually go in there and see that one. Ah, there we go. The clinic is down there. Oh my god. They make this a lot of effort to finally use the clinic. Be treated. It's Tenji. They get rid of the poison and I don't have to use an item. It's fine. I swear, it's fine. No items, though. No, there's only one other area I don't think I've been to. Because I've always been kind of the guy that just rushed through the game, never really looked at shit. It's a problem. It's a problem. But, um... It's okay. Her face was creepy there. That's okay. Okay, there's no, it's just a loop. It's just a loop. Well, I'm going to talk to that woman and that kid. I doubt they have anything for me. Sir Lavage were safe. First knighthood and all. Kid with a broom. He, he can't wait to be a knight. I don't know why you'd want to be a knight. They die, dude. They die. Okay. Now we just get a save. And then we can end this long episode of hunting down Stardust and traveling around Bail. Basically, just for information, Stardust and uh, collect all the treasure chests we could find. Now that she's not poisoned, things are good in the hood. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of The Legend of Dragoon. Probably shouldn't have saved over that one. And I'll see y'all in the next episode of The Legend of Dragoon. Take care until then, guys. Bye bye